the third season of his Dark Materials will undoubtedly bring Lyra's fantasy story to a stunning finish. By the end of 2022, the third and final season, based on Philip Pullman's third book The Amber Spyglass, should be available on television. The BBC has not, however, announced the precise date of release. As you can expect, the cast had a difficult time saying farewell, especially lead actress Daphne Keane. She told Collider in December 2020, I'm trying not to think about it because I think a lot and I'm really, really looking forward to getting back. I've known the people on set for a few years now, and they've become my second family. They have watched me mature, and I genuinely miss them. I am eager to return. People always say, I can't wait for vacation, but I can't wait to start filming again. Here is all the information you need to know about Season 3 of His Dark Materials. His Dark Materials Season 3 Potential Release Date When will it air? His Dark Materials Season 3 has yet to receive an official air date. However, after ending up filming at the end of November 2021, it is currently in post-production. The official His Dark Materials account posted on Twitter, It has been an incredible six-year journey through the worlds of hashtag His Dark Materials, but it's time to close the doors on the final chapter. That's a wrap on Season 3. Both the BBC and HBO have given the previous two seasons top billing in their winter schedules. They began airing in November and continued until the end of December, wrapping up right before Christmas. We'd wager that they're aiming for a similar release date in 2022 given the amount of post-production work required including the CGI required to generate every character's demons. And on the Zoe Ball Breakfast show on BBC Radio 2, Ruth Wilson did give away a possible release date, stating that season 3 of his Dark Materials will run this November. That's what I'm hearing. She remarked before revealing to the audience that the previous season's events will come to a head in the upcoming episodes. The tale of the final book was originally intended to be divided across two seasons rather than one, but sadly it was not feasible to make it work. I had intended to divide it in half, but we're only doing one. You won't always get your wish. Deadline was informed by executive producer Jane Tranter. I'm just a glutton. The television screen is one of my favorites. The Amber Spyglass is appropriately adapted into eight episodes, and I will fully and humbly admit I was completely wrong in talking out my butt. I like stories told really slowly and that kind of like, let's really dig into this. But truthfully, that was me just longing to go on making his dark materials for the rest of my life, the author said. Once we have any additional concrete information on a release date, we'll keep you informed. His Dark Materials Season 3 cast, who's coming back? The characters of Lyra, Will, Mrs. Coulter, Mary Malone, Serafina Piccola, Father Mac Fail, and Lord Asriel will all be present, according to the BBC. At the conclusion of Season 2, Lord Asriel unexpectedly made a cameo appearance after missing a significant portion of Lyra's escapades. Lyra had always known the self-centered explorer as her uncle, so when she learned he was actually her biological father, she was horrified. James McAvoy appeared to be out of the running for the second season after he vanished, but creator Jack Thorne admitted the actor was essential to make it work. He stated to Radio Times, Dan McCulloch, the executive producer, worked miracles to make it possible, and James McAvoy kindly and beautifully came in and gave us a COVID day. It was wonderful to watch James get on his feet and shout towards the sky. It is one of the qualities I most like in him. I'm grateful to the previewers for not giving anything away, and I'm very happy that it has remained a secret up until this point. Adwela Kinoy Agbage from Suicide Squad, Jamie Ward from The Durls, and Amber Fitzgerald Wolf as Amar are some of the new additions to the cast. As the Rebel Angels Balthamos, Baruch, and Zephania, respectively, Kavna Holbrook Smith, Simon Harrison, and Chipo Chung will make appearances. Jonathan Aris and Cyan Clifford will also appear in Season 3 as Commander Roke and Agent Salmakia, respectively. In the final Pullman book, they are well known as the Galavespian spies. We might possibly run into Lyra's Season 1 co-star in Pal Roger. In Season 2, Colonel John Perry, Lord Boreal, and Lee Scoresby all met their demise. While we wouldn't bet the farm on their not returning, it seems plausible that they are no longer alive. It is unknown how the writers would handle the fact that Lord Asriel's demon Stalmeria was voiced by Peaky Blinders actress Helen McCrory who passed away in April 2021. According to McAvoy, we haven't thought about it. I don't believe we want to discuss it, but when we do, someone else will be honored to take her place, if not with actual footsteps, then certainly with voice steps. Speaking of the cast, the third season of His Dark Materials will add a new member to the group. The show's more complicated monsters, the Milefa, will be introduced in the third and final season, upping the fantasy ante. The Zalif, a sentient entity that will make an appearance in the upcoming series, has supposedly had a difficult time making the leap from the book to the screen. Executive producer Jane Tranter explained how they were adapted to Entertainment Weekly. We'd talked about it a lot since it was what we were afraid of. If you desire, we would address the Milefa in the room continually. There is much to anticipate as the Milefa of his Dark Materials are expected to change slightly from what we have read in the books. His Dark Materials Season 3 Plot, What Will Happen? The Amber Spyglass, the third and concluding volume in Philip Pullman's His Dark Materials novel trilogy, serves as the basis for the upcoming season. Asriel is working to establish a new Republic of Heaven as the insurrection against the Authority escalates into open combat. 
but in order to accomplish his goals, he requires the subtle knife, which is in Will's possession right now. The Amber Spyglass is the most magnificently complex of Philip Pullman's books to translate for TV. But Tranter told Radio Times that with his team's world-class creative team in Cardiff, no project is too difficult. This season is a tale of love and truth as well as a grand adventure. The brilliant worlds of Philip are beautifully depicted in Jack, Francesca, and Amelia's scripts, and we are joined by our beloved existing cast and some fantastic newcomers to the series. Some images with gloomy, gritty captions have been shared on the His Dark Materials Twitter account The End Has Come. The Amber Spyglass, hashtag His Dark Materials. Not at least foreboding. Mrs. Coulter has Lyra in custody because she wants to prevent her daughter from carrying out the witch's prophecy and becoming the second Eve, which would save humanity. Before the season 2 finale, Jack Thorne discussed the role with the beat, saying of Mrs. Coulter, I hope that we walk the line where you can see Mrs. Coulter in two ways. You can see someone who is bent on chasing both power and Lyra, and there is a contradiction within her to what she genuinely wants, and she hasn't answered the question, the author said. We would anticipate visiting other worlds, such as the Land of the Dead and one where elephant-like monsters known as Milefa roam, as well as learning more about the angels. Additionally, in Season 2, there was a scene involving a certain bench in the second episode that referenced a pivotal moment in the third book and gave a hint as to how the series will end. Fill your boots, guys, because we are about to plunge into all of that and more. Fans can anticipate a deeper and darker journey in Season 3, as is so frequently the case. According to Wilson, I think it's a lot darker and sadder. Undoubtedly, it is more emotional. I believe that filming it was more difficult. There is a lot more happening, and I believe there are also a lot more characters introduced. There is a lot to be excited about. He responded, love, loss, and death, when asked to sum up the season in three words. That doesn't sound really enjoyable. Whatever transpires, the series is going to be huge. We can anticipate seeing the same amount of action and emotion on screen as in the Amber Spyglass. His Dark Materials Season 3 trailer, when can I see it? The third season of His Dark Materials has finished filming, but the first trailer has yet to be released. We might still have to wait if it doesn't air until late 2022. When we learn more, we'll let you know. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more.